How feel you when the day that you've been born, somebody else is already planning the day of your execution? How feel you that if somebody think that you'd not be more than a product, see you like an opium that they can treat without punishment? Say that some that you like that matter it all. If you be put on this world in their eyes only to serve them like a slime with no and with no I think you want that the world change in this moment. Is it not? I think you want that the world change. I think you want that the world give you your freedom back that you deserve. Is it not? But this is how it be. Any day of any moment, of any second of this world, billions of animals have been treated like objects, living sensuous creatures, just like you. But in central nervous system you can feel pain just like you. Being treated like nothing, but being put in concentration camps, called factory farms, and their children be stolen from them, then being used for meat or being turned in veal dairy in the stream. The only reason that they're being dairy that they're being veal is that actually this is with the only reason that they're being veal is veal of cow baby calves that turn into a veal that's what the marketing term of the bean actually um is that there have been uh, mother cows that have been uh, raped? Actually, they call they use the term insemination, but they're being put in rape racks. Not the term where vegans might make it, but it's actually in terms of the meat industry, of the, of the um, industry themselves. Then there are children being stolen away from them after born. Then their children may put in little cages, in fats, in a small cage where they're not can move. Then the mothers being drowned, not being put all products on their nipples when they're they pant all the milk from them away. And put them, these children of them. Yeah, then uh, the children, the mother cow is again raped. Any year, cow is being raped by the dairy industry, and then the children be stolen away. How few will you win that? To, to, when you've been a woman, I think you can understand how it feels when your children are stolen from you. I think you can imagine how they feel when they do that to you. I think men cannot feel, can see it as well. If they try. But men have not, in most cases, men have not, have a harder time to uh, realize to others. 
because society the way society is understand that but I think you can understand that you can watch really and then after four years four to five years the cows being put on another concentration camp truck and then being put to the execution to the Auschwitz to the Birkenau being called Slaughterhouses and if you think that there is something is main slaughter I want to say this or you also think that there has been something as a humane as a humane holocaust or a humane concentration camp or humane slavery be not stupid don't, don't exist if I win a serial killer and I, and I only murder people that the weak intelligence and I do and I give them antibiotic uh, medicines and sleep medication so that they don't feel pain. Is it okay to do that? A lot of animals be smarter than mental or retarded people according to and research. be right. Politicians only allowed criminal acts to happen. Take sides. Neutrality helps the oppressor, not the victim. Silence encourages the tormentor, not the tormented. There's no silence. There's no such thing as weakness. If, let us say this, there is something like a weakness. If somebody has no comfort and don't want to change their behavior, but I don't want to develop to believe that they don't can understand something. Like kindness. Like is compassion then to them. Like turn them not to Christ. Why not use people that rape, murder, this kind of people in fever sex laboratories use them use the bodies to get actually scientific that can be used to help people form change instead that they do experiments to animals they then have again test on humans retards of the vivisection retard industry <laughs> if something at the fifth section you do something and it is stop the progress of regularly sign fifth section is a scam and it is idiots and this is something barbarics that have to have, have stopped have to be stopped long ago it's not from this century this 2006 stop the insanity you uh, you be not a cave one anymore you be not a caveman oh what this is a choice Look it on the internet. Look on the internet. You can find it if you want. It is a choice. It is a choice. But it is not a right for choice to do it to other living beings. In the pig industry, they are castrated with no any, no 
with no painkillers, baby pigs. With a scalp knife. Then the children have put away from the the in the pig industry. They put the pigs in small places where they not can move. Actually, the cage of the pigs is exactly the same. With a little bit of space, maybe half half pig. Actually, well, a little bit. Oh, what space is the pigs? So that they uh, can put on the ground. The pig industry also give these animals more antibiotics. They cut their teeth, so break the teeth of the baby pigs. <laughs> these innocent living creatures. It's just a couple of days old. And if the pigs don't grow enough, fast enough, they're being killed and turned in pet food or be feed to uh, other pigs. Pigs can, uh, can live for some time of uh, 51, uh, 50, mm. to 550 mm. uh, years. So. But the pigs in the pig industry most of the time don't live more than a couple of four years. In the chicken industry, let I talk a little bit about that. In the chicken industry, they cut the meals from uh, the baby chicks. And then there's eggs being uh, cut so that they don't can pick each other in their overcrowded conditions. Then the chickens being uh, put to a uh, uh, chicken farm. And then they're being put with thousands of other chickens in, uh, in one room. In one room. Uh, and they're being then uh, they live there for a couple of I left a month, I left them to oh, 60 months and then the concentration truck comes again and also the feces of the chickens be not put away by the chicken farmers for that long of time most cases and uh, so the chickens have to live in their own on their own uh, dirt and uh, rain. And so the chickens also uh, get diseases like crazy bird disease. And they also can get to uh, humans. Actually, then there'll be mutants of that diseases that will be around in our society. The, um, actually, there's something about the gallery industry. Oh, you also were aware that the same exact, a same essence. Nice. Yeah, that we know in for the data create Alzheimer. We also we also cast thing um, mad countesses, same as on SMS. So also other kinds of diseases we also linked to the dairy industry. If if I say the the um, satanistic rape industry. That's how it'd be. They're raping innocent animals. Only for the only for the sake of money. Whatever roots of evil. The tree of darkness. The tree of evil. The tree of insanity. Where the chickens after the kind of months they've been uh, put on again uh, with uh, the concentration train. And they've been put in long strike and they've been then the throat and this light and then being bleeding to that. If you like this video, give this video a thumbs up. The next time I try to be a little bit more at the carp. Give this video a thumbs up or you like. Subscribe to my Instagram, my YouTube and my Google Plus. And I'll see you next time. The dragon is out. The fire is breathing. Cop the fire up. Give compassion to another living beings. Be not selfish, stand for something. Stand for being right. And be not blind. Play me more times the um, funny comedian philosopher. I think that's a very good thing if people 
get that more on school to think we are more like um, would uh, people see more the truth but they be not so much fooled by society's lies and they don't live or don't need the cult of society to be happy big businesses would be not uh, something that I support actually I support little businesses but just not one.